This is not supposed to be a sad vlog, but I gotta tell you guys, this week I lost, or we lost, a very good friend. Uh, Garm's, uh, Garm's previous owner, Ben, passed away this week uh, due to cancer. Um, I, was, I have been so sad. I haven't really gotten uh, the time to do the things that I should do, but now Eventually, I am getting on track again, and of course, I wanted to do this vlog because I have promised I will make one a week, and of course, that is every Saturday. So, um, uh, Ben was an amazing uh, uh, human being, amazing man. He was uh, always helping, and what he stood for uh, within uh, the, the fishing industry local fishermen's laws and rights and he has fought them so f so for so uh, long uh, and, uh, and uh, he will truly be missed. There are so many things happening right now. Uh, for a couple of years ago we uh, thought about getting Elna's daddy's old house, the house which he grew up in, where he grew up. Uh, which were and uh, we have been thinking about it talking about it and a couple of weeks ago we went to this place and stayed for the weekend just to check out uh, if this was a project that we really wanted and of course uh, it is um, there are a lot of interest for this house there are other people that want to buy it so we're not sure if we will be able to buy it but we will do our best uh, the other thing is that uh, we have been um, trying to get a hold of uh, TMMY for um, uh, more pictures and more uh, videos uh, or video updates of the Twin Otter which is uh, hard at this time because he has a lot of orders uh, with the Cessnas and the DC3s and so on. So the Twin Otter is some kind or somehow a buy project that he works on. It annoys me a bit but I have said yes to this so I just have to wait and hopefully I will get more updates within the next week and of course that will be on our Saturday vlog of course and many of you probably wonder where the hell are you now and I'm at a place called Holmen uh, this is a beautiful place just right outside Meham it takes about 10 minutes to walk into the little village I'm going to show you here Here you have the possibility to rent small cabins and have a great time. But once a year in October we have something called the Meam Fair. It's uh, a place where uh, uh, local stores all around this area and in Finnmark as well are um, putting out their stuff for sale, uh, small stores and so on. You can buy snowmobiles and clothes and yeah, everything from A to Y, A to Z, A to the B. <laughs> and I'm going to check it out. Uh, it's in our gym, so the, the, the lightning or the lighting is quite bad. And you know this because of our previous videos. And I still haven't got my studio up and running. It won't. It won't be up before uh, uh, before uh, next summer. And until then, there will be no uh, new equipment for filming and so on. And we will, of course. Uh, think more about uh, the RC flying as well. Uh, we are trying to get a hold of uh, a couple of big helis and some new planes as well. So, But anyway, enough talk. We go to the fair now.
So what we want you guys to try to figure out is what motor to use in this one and what ESC. If you have something lying around that you think will fit this boat and you are prepared to sell it, just uh, write a comment in the comment section below and we will of course um, check it out and perhaps buy it. And this is a 13 centimeter propeller. It's insane. Uh, you also had the drawings for it. Let's check it out. This is mainly what the boat should look like. And of course, the plane you all been waiting for the whole summer, which is still standing on the bed. That is this beautiful Phoenix model. Um, not sure what the name of it is, but we hope that we will manage a maiden flight on it before the snow comes. And if the snow comes, we will just put ski on it. So do you agree, Bjorn Korea? Yeah. Should we get it in the air now? Someday. <laughs> Someday.